Winning Britain's Got Talent has changed my life completely. As well as performing on the Royal Variety Show in front of Prince Charles, I performed on the Queen's 90th birthday celebrations, and I headlined a huge West End magic show. But it's always nice to go back to where it all began, so I'm going back to the London auditions for the new series of Britain's Got Talent to catch up with some old friends. Amanda, Alicia, it's so Hello, good to see you. you. How are you? Really well. Really well. Yes. Are you enjoying the new series of BGT? How's yes. it going? Loving it. Bonkers <laughs> as yeah. usual. Good. Yes. Good. <laughs> seen any army guys yet? No. 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 We haven't had many this year. No, not one. I think it's because you finished them off. Oh, really? Yeah. What about magicians? There must be loads of magicians. We have a few. Yeah. I think good you've inspired ones. a lot of people mm -hmm. to good. come on the show. Now, I wanted to try something with you both while, while I've got you. Dirty yeah. beast. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's not as dirty as it sounds. Uh, I'm going to ask you both to think of something in your mind. Um, Amanda, I'm going to ask you to think of a celebrity. It could be someone you know or someone that you'd like to meet, someone you'd like to spend a lot of time with. Um, and Alicia, I'm going to ask you to think of a famous landmark. OK, I interesting. <laughs> okay. Um, so I'm going to now draw you a little picture. I'm going to try and figure out what it is you're thinking of. Uh, Alicia, I'm going to start with yourself. Keep thinking of the landmark over and over again in your mind now. Uh, like, keep saying it over and over and over again in your mind. Interesting. Um, <laughs> and Amanda, if you could do the same, so keep thinking of your celebrity over and over and over again. Now, my drawings aren't actually very good at all. I'm going to write above it what it is. Plain picture <laughs> Just so that there's uh, no discrepancy, so you know exactly what it is. Because it's going to be embarrassing. OK, good stuff. OK, so my prediction is set. I've drawn you a little picture. I'm going to start with yourself, Alicia. OK. Please tell us, what is the famous landmark? The Eiffel Tower. The Eiffel Tower? Yes. Oh, bien sûr. What's interesting is that is exactly what I drew here, the Eiffel Tower. Amazing. It's not a bad drawing. It's not it's too bad, right? Drawing. And Amanda. You did need to put Eiffel Tower in there. <laughs> <laughs> if we didn't get that, we'd be worried. Yeah, I thought you might think it was the Blackpool Tower or something like that. That's what worried me. Uh, Amanda, you're thinking of a celebrity, right? Yes. Who is the celebrity you're thinking of? Daniel Craig. Daniel Craig. Now, believe it or not, he is actually in the picture. If I make it slightly clearer for you. There we have. That's amazing. The Eiffel Tower. Wow. On the other side, we have Mr. Daniel Craig. Wow. That's amazing. Oh my God. Good. So How did you so... do it? He seems very easy to read. That's all good. <laughs> <laughs> it's lovely to see you. Thank, Thank you, you so much for a great Good luck with everything. Yes. Good and with yeah, everything. enjoy the well new done. series. Thank I look forward you. to seeing it on TV. Thanks. It's nice. It's lovely. Lovely. <laughs>